In this video, I'll show you how to set up your launch key in FL Studio and give you an overview of the functions on the launch key. Connect your launch key to your computer using the provided USB cable. Open FL Studio and go to Options and MIDI settings. On a PC, select Launch Key Mark III MIDI under Output and Input. On a Mac, select Launch Key Mark III MIDI port under Output and Input. Under Controller Type, select Generic Controller and select Enable. Select Send Master Sync under the Output menu, ensuring that the launch key is selected. Your launch key is now set up and ready to use with FL Studio. If you want to control parameters inside plugins using your launch key, open the plugin, right click on the parameter that you wish to control, and then move the pop, pad, or fader that you wish to control that parameter with. You can now use this to record in automation live. Let's have a brief look at the new features of the Launch Key Mark III. This applies to the Launch Key 25, 37, 49, and 61. Fixed chord mode lets you easily play and build your own complex chords. The Creative Arpeggiator allows you to quickly find new melodies, sounds, and rhythms. Scale Mode allows you to map all the notes you play to your chosen key. Scale Chord Mode generates a bank of chords based on your selected scale. User Chord Mode allows you to assign 16 custom chords to the pads. Custom Modes allow you to create custom mappings for any performance or studio rig using Novation components. These can be created for the pots, the pads, and also for the faders if you're using a launch key 49 or 61. You can learn more about all of these great features in the in-depth tutorials.